my friends! Welcome to the 30 days rank push challenge, where I'm uploading a new ML guide for 30 days straight. We're on day 2 today. Here you have the full upload plan for the challenge. Today we're going to talk about two mage items, Enchanted Talisman and Fleeing Time. First, the five shoutouts of the day first, the five shoutouts of the day goes to Derek Steve, you're welcome. Mizuki Haru, what's wrong with my pronunciations? Uh Shri Krish Krishna Shresta Shresta Nailed it. Sokna Choi Rum, you're welcome as well. And Zoom 13. Well, now it might backfire at you, buddy. Sorry. If you want to have the chance to get a shout out in the next video, just write something nice in the comments. Last quick note, don't forget about the giveaway I'm running for the challenge. The rules and all information you need, you will find in the description box below. Also, I've catched a cold, so my voice could be a bit blah. So my voice could be a bit broken at some points. Now, let's get into today's topic. First we got through the stats of Enchanted Talisman. This item is quite simple to understand, I think. You will get plus 250 HP, plus 50 magic power, and plus 20% cooldown reduction. And this item has two effects. The first one is called Mana Spring. It restores 15% of your maximum mana every 10 seconds. What means if we do the math, 1.5% mana regeneration per second. The second one is called Magic Mastery. Your max cooldown reduction is reduced by 5%. So, let me show you how both effects work. I'm using Kadita for the demonstration. The mana regen is self-explaining, I think. As you can see, my mana goes up higher and higher. This effect is really useful for all magic damage based heroes who have a really high mana usage. Examples are Sicilian or Lilia. For the second effect, the maximum cooldown reduction is normally kept at 40%. With this item, it increases to max 45%, which is really great for all magic based heroes who rely on cooldown reduction items, for example Cyclops or Harath. So, who is this item for? I think you could answer this for yourself. You want this item for magic damage based heroes who have a high mana usage and benefit from the cooldown reduction. When you build this item, make sure to build other items with cooldown reduction, so you get the full 45% reduction out of it. Now it's time for today's secret code. It is… time. Again, check out the description with all infos about the giveaway. Now, let's talk about fleeing time. We start again with the stats. You get plus 70 magic power, plus 350 mana and plus 15% cooldown reduction. This item has one effect, it's called time stream. After an elimination or an assist, the cooldown of the hero's ultimate is immediately reduced by 30%. I'm using Kadita again for the demonstration. When I'm attacking this poor Layla bot with her ult, the cooldown of it is 24 seconds. Now after I eliminated her, the cooldown get reduced to 17 seconds. If I eliminate multiple enemies, it get reduced each time. But importantly, the cooldown get reduced by 30% of the current cooldown time. What means if I eliminate 3 heroes, it's not reduced by 90%. It get reduced each time by 30% of the current cooldown time. Here you have the math. The same applies for assists, as mentioned. So, who is this item for? In general, it's for all magic based heroes who greatly take advantage of a cooldown reduction for their ultimate. Examples are supports like Angela, mages like Kadita or Vale, assassins like Gushin or Harley, or fighters like Guinevere. What you shouldn't do is build it on heroes who have either a very short ultimate cooldown anyway, or heroes who are based on physical damage. The 30% cooldown reduction is not worth it to waste an entire item slot with magic power, which you don't need at all as physical damage based hero. You can combine it with pretty much any magic item. This item is made for certain heroes who greatly benefit from the cooldown reduction and not to combine it with certain items. Now, go and check out the whole challenge playlist or if you are a daily viewer, see you tomorrow. Have a great day!